Welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you how to move objects in photos using AI on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. So begin by enabling the AI editing tool for your photos app or for your gallery app. And to do that, open settings. And in settings, you want to scroll and select Galaxy AI. And then from here, look for photo assist and tap on it. Next, ensure that this feature has been turned on. So once it's been enabled, you want now to open your gallery, then select the image you want to edit. Once you've selected your image, tap on the edit icon here. And then you should see this AI button on your screen. You want to tap on it. And now you can start editing with your photo, with your photo AI. So you want to sketch around the object you want to move. So say for example, I want to move this phone. So I'm going to draw around it. And then once it's been selected, you want to long press on what you've drawn around. And then you want to move it to whatever location you want. So I can even choose to move it up here to somewhere like that. Then once you found your location, you can now let go of the photo or sorry, of the object. And then you can increase its size or decrease it however you'd like. Once you've done that, and you've, you can tap on generate and then wait for the image or for that place you've removed your object to be filled in. So it may take a while depending on how much it has to fill in. So just wait patiently. Then once it's filled in, you should see the edit it's done to the image. And when you tap on view original, you can see the original copy and then you can see the newly edited AI image. So if you're fine with it, just tap on done. And you can see that you've now successfully moved the object. So now you can continue editing your image if you'd prefer. And then when you're done, just tap on save copy. And you'll notice on your image, it says at the bottom with a tag AI generated content. So that tag tells you that this isn't the original copy. It's an AI generated image because you've moved the object. And you can do this for as any other photos that you have on your phone. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.